Streams 030 is out and as always we will have a quick look at what's new in this release. It has over 100 PRs from over 15 contributors. Thanks to everyone who contributed. It supports Apache Kafka versions 3.1.0, 3.1.1 and 3.2.0. It removes the support for Apache Kafka 3.0.0 and 3.0.1. The main change is that the use streams pod sets feature gate is now moved to beta stage. That means that streams pod sets are enabled and used by default. But if needed, they can still be disabled. If you want to learn more about Streamsy Podsets, what they are and why are we using them, you can check out our YouTube video which is only about Streamsy Podsets. When upgrading to Streamsy 030, the operator will automatically migrate from stateful sets to Streamsy Podsets. Similarly, when downgrading to Streamsy 028 or 029, the operator will automatically migrate back from Streamsy Podsets to stateful sets. Only when downgrading to Streamsy 027 or older, you first need to disable the use Streamsy Podset feature gate and only then do the downgrade. Another change is that the service account patching feature gate is moving to the GA stage. That means that it is now always enabled and cannot be disabled anymore. The service accounts are now reconciled in every reconciliation loop as any other resource managed by Streamsy. That means that the service account metadata can now be configured through the custom resources. The operator now also emits Kubernetes events when it rolls the Kafka brokers. That makes it easier to track the broker restarts done by the operator and it also explains the reasons for the restart. You can use kubectl or the Kubernetes API to follow the events. You can now also override the CPU and network capacity for individual brokers with cruise control and you have better configurability of the Kafka admin client used in the user operator. The experimental craft mode now supports simple authorization as well. And as always, there are many smaller improvements, bug fixes and dependency updates. Hopefully you enjoy this release and to make sure you don't miss any other news, Make sure to follow us on Twitter and subscribe to our YouTube channel.